everybody, welcome back to Taz's Wig Closet at Wig Studio One. Today we're going to talk about three popular bob styles from recent years by Raquel Welch. We're going to examine the differences among them coming up. I purchased all three of these styles with my own funds from Wig Studio One. We invite you to shop with Wig Studio One if you go below the video. Expand the description box, you'll see links to all three of these styles. You can explore the details and pricing. Also check out the promo code. We often love and attach ourselves to a particular style. Um, so if you like the Straight Up With a Twist by Raquel Welch, wouldn't you love to know that there are some other styles that you could go to that offer the same color and are just a little bit different, maybe a, sh a fresh updated look, like you went to the salon. Um, and I think these three styles that I'm gonna show you today are gonna offer that to you. So uh, this straight up with a twist was rolled out in 2016. It's uh, more of a traditional style bob, but it has some razoring, a little bit just to give it a twist, just to give it a little modern kick. And so many of us love this. But let's say you love the general look of this style, but you just want a little bit of a fresh tweak. I think these other two styles that I'm gonna show you are slightly different than this one, um, and it can offer you amazing options for sister styles. Uh, so that's the beauty of it. So even though it's not a huge difference in style, like they seem like they're coming out with the same styles all the time, I look at that as a positive thing because then you can buy that style have a little bit of variation in your styling um, and with a fresh updated look because you can get the same color. Um, so that is my opinion. I absolutely love that and that's why I chose to show you these three styles today. They're among my favorite bobs uh, from Raquel Welch. I think the Raquel Welch brand does an amazing job of presenting a lot of different variations of the bob style cut. What I'm wearing here is straight up with the twist and I think this one came out if I'm not mistaken, 2016. Now, I would consider this more of a classic bob just because I'm getting a little bit of full and roundness in the middle. It kind of has an inward curve, but there is a twist that it's a little bit updated, a little bit modernized. And they started to use some razoring here on these layers. Okay, it gave it a, a little bit of a more wispy appearance instead of a thick blunt cut on some of the traditional bobs. There's a little bit of layering in the back, yet it retains, um, like I said, some of that classic look. The straight up with the twist has a longer fringe at about eight inches. So the first one that I want to compare is the one that came out, I think spring of 2020. It was only available for online purchase. This one's called Real Deal. So let's take a look. So this is Real Deal. There's a little more layering and there's a little more razoring um, of the end. So it's a very, very modern twist. So right away, you're gonna see that that front piece is about six and a half inches as opposed to the eight. It's also six and a half on the crown as opposed to the eight. But then there's multiple layers on the sides and then right around a two and a half inch nape. But you can really sense this texture in those layers. It's just been thinned and, and texturized all over. And it does just appear like a little bit of a shorter, more modern look um, on the straight up with the twist. So the straight up with the twist has more of a traditional feel to it. And then the real deal really takes it to that next level with some of that modern razoring. So let's talk about the twist on this one. Um, so. Flirting with Fashion has about a four and a half inch piece, so they've really shortened up that front. Seems to be a little more practical. And then about a six and a half inch crown area and about a two, two and a half inch nape, okay? The sides here are about six inches, so uh, that does still come down to about the same length as the straight up with the twist here. So again, it just appears that this style has even come further along yet. So the migration has been from the straight up with the twist with a little bit of more of a traditional look and feel to the real deal uh, with some nice texture and volume, very modern, fresh looking cut, and then even maybe further than with the flirting with fashion.